We're a short few seconds away from the uh, fourth NSG game here in Austin, Texas. Uh, Daryl Russell and Andy Coverstone are back. Uh, my mother tongue. Good tackle. Good, Good robust tackle. A little flick over there from defence. And he out he comes with the ball on the left hand off oh, the right hand side here. Yeah, and he off he goes. Managed to change of pace, try to put the ball in box, got a second opportunity. Ramos picks it up, but unable to maintain control. And ball breaks away quickly with the West, but picked up again by Newbury, it looks like. Um for the east, then shifts it out. I can't can't determine the size, but uh, you know, it's hard to look on video sometimes, but there looks like a you know some very big physical players in this game today and uh, you know guys not frightened to use their bodies ball out wide now Ramos has continued his run as he's laid it off this is Lee on the ball here for the west on the wide left hand side dispossessed by uh, by uh, Newberry I believe Newberry back on the ball again Shooting to Ailman. In the line and forcing the West to have to play a long, long ball inside. Big ball into the box, deep but well headed out. Only as far as Newbury, who tried to make a quick turn, might have earned himself a corner. Saying Newbury's name a lot, he, we've, we've, he's gotten himself around the uh, around the field here on the right hand side at least. Yeah, he definitely looks exciting, you know. And uh, anyone that's going to try a Rabona pass in a game <laughs> of this type of magnitude, you know, for him, um, he's got to have a lot of confidence about him. He's got to yeah. have a little bit of confidence, a little bit of arrogance. I don't mind that at all. So, uh, obviously, we want to try and see if we get him on the ball a little bit more and utilise some of that ability that he must have. But they go all the way back to centre-back, who looks now to shift it out to the left-hand side. And he manages to that, but... Uh, Newbury yeah. back in the action again, picks up a ball and, and gets it back into his midfield of games all the time, you know, and uh, they're, they're looking for something different. They're looking for that that that, that, that player that can, they can trust, you know, they know what they're going to get from him. And even like a guy like we've noticed Newbury now a couple of times, just the way he puts himself about, the way his presence on the ball is. So we've got a second yeah, half definitely. underway. Yeah, second half underway with here with Daryl Russell and Andy Coverstone. Um, Hopefully trying to help you along with some of the action that's going on in this game. And uh, it, it's the uh, our, our fourth NSG game. 3-1, half-time to the West. I did. Into half, I think it might be. But a scruffy ball through, but a little touch there by Hand Handley. But uh, unable to get a good, a good enough touch to direct it into Hecky. And on the outside here, we've got Newbury on the ball, driving forward. Yeah, looks like that took a good Ramos in the box now, he's doing his best work in the box. This left-hand side, but opted to go a little bit too central and was cleaned up tidily by the West central defender. I think it might be Smith. Newbury getting himself a, a little tangle. Better from the east now as they've gotten forward a few times here. Yeah, and you, you wonder in the East have had, had a little bit more better position. Well, they've had the best of the lion's share possession in these last few moments. And it's, it's kind of changed. The, the, the ebb and flow of the game has definitely changed possession-wise. We've got an opportunity to hit him indeed. ...ball quite a bit for the West here. Um, he's had a lot of space to play in for sure, but, but he's been on the ball quite a bit there in the central, central midfield. Um, Newbury. 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 Very unfortunately with his with his, with his pass that cost him. Um, Hagen has done well. It's just like, like, like you know, and again, it's great talent on display. 